Hello, everyone. Welcome to Tokyo Tokimeki Channel. I'm your host, Yoshinari. Today, we're responding to your requests and presenting the top 10 must visit spots in Japan for first time travelers. Whether you're planning your first trip to Japan or just dreaming about it, these spots are sure to make your experience unforgettable. Let's get started. At number 10, we have Asakusa and the Sensoji Temple in Tokyo. This is a perfect spot for first time visitors because it offers a taste of traditional Japan right in the heart of the city. You can explore the historic temple, walk through the bustling Nakamai shopping street, and even take a rickshaw ride. Example, imagine strolling down Nakamai Street, snacking on freshly made ningyoyaki, doll shaped cakes, and taking in the sights and sounds of traditional Tokyo. Number nine is the Hiroshima Peace Memorial Park. This spot is essential for understanding Japan's history and its message of peace. The park is both a beautiful and sobering place, perfect for reflecting on the past and hoping for a better future. Example, picture yourself standing in front of the atomic bomb dome, feeling the weight of history and the hope for peace. In eighth place, we have Nara Park. Famous for its friendly deer that roam freely, Nara Park is also home to the Todaiji Temple, which houses the great Buddha statue. This spot offers a unique and serene experience, perfect for first time visitors who want to experience Japan's natural beauty and rich history. Example, Imagine feeding the deer and then visiting the awe-inspiring Great Buddha. It's a day filled with nature and culture. Number seven is the Fushimi Inari Shrine in Kyoto. Known for its thousands of red tori gates, this shrine is a must visit for its stunning beauty and spiritual atmosphere. The hike through the tori gates provides a unique and memorable experience. Example, picture yourself walking through the endless rows of red gates, each step taking you deeper into the tranquil forest. It's like stepping into another world. At sixth place is Osaka's Dotonbori district. This area is famous for its vibrant nightlife, neon lights, and delicious street food. It's a must visit for first time travelers looking to experience the lively and fun side of Japan. Example, imagine enjoying takoyaki, octopus balls, while watching the iconic Glico Man sign light up the night. It's a feast for the senses. Number five is Mount Fuji. This iconic mountain is a symbol of Japan and offers breathtaking views. Whether you choose to climb it or just admire it from a distance, Mount Fuji is a must see for any visitor. Example, picture yourself taking a scenic train ride to Hakone, where you can soak in an onsen, hot spring, with a perfect view of Mount Fuji. It's the ultimate relaxation. In fourth place, we have the Arashiyama Bamboo Grove in Kyoto. Walking through this bamboo forest feels like entering a different world. It's a serene and beautiful experience that's perfect for first time travelers. Example, imagine the soothing sound of the bamboo swaying in the wind as you walk through this magical grove. It's a photographer's paradise. Number three is Shibuya Crossing in Tokyo. Known as the busiest pedestrian crossing in the world, Shibuya Crossing is a must see for its sheer scale and energy. It's a true symbol of modern Tokyo. Example, Picture yourself in the middle of the scramble, surrounded by hundreds of people, neon lights, and the bustling city life. It's an unforgettable experience. At second place is the Golden Pavilion, or Kinkakuji, in Kyoto. This stunning temple covered in gold leaf is one of Japan's most iconic sites. It's a must visit for its beauty and historical significance. Example, imagine the sun reflecting off the golden temple and onto the peaceful pond. It's a sight that will leave you in awe. Finally, at number one, we have Tokyo Tower. This iconic landmark offers breathtaking views of Tokyo and is a must visit for first time travelers. The tower itself is a symbol of Japan's post war rebirth and modernization. Example Picture yourself at the top of Tokyo Tower, taking in the panoramic view of the city below. It's the perfect way to start or end your Japan adventure. So, what do you think? Have you visited any of these spots? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon. For more exciting content about Japan, we're always open to your requests and questions. See you in the next video.